Get, let's slay this game. Action. We're playing true crime or CBC? Plotline. Here we go. Okay. A bunch of people who invested in Miami Springs real estate find out a little too late that it was all a con and the property doesn't even exist. True. True. Crime. Are you kidding me? That was stolen from truth. While two officers are giving a lecture at a forensic science body farm, mm. they discover the body of a long missing person who isn't supposed to be there. CBC Plotline. Plot we got it. We got it. Police discovered an innovative attempt at smuggling when they intercepted a homing pigeon wearing a tiny gray knapsack. I want it to be true. I don't think it's true. I think it's a plot line. line? So wait, do I have all the truth? Wait. Wait, so I was wrong. I, I don't know why I'm walking away. I was wrong. I think I'm so excited that it was true. I just said the pigeon So the two of mine have been wrong and hers has been right. That is some foul-ish. 20 years after he was kidnapped as a child, a wealthy, Air resurfaces, except it turns out he's not their heir, but the man who killed the original kidnapper. What? This is intense. The man who, that definitely is a plot line. Cause that just can't be real. <laughs> Murdoch mystery, oh, plot line, plot line. Plot line, Murdoch. Next question. Here we go. A man who tried to rob someone later called 911 in an effort to pass himself off as the victim of the robbery. True. Yes! Okay. An attempted robbery suspect fled a convenience store after being hit by a banana. Banana. There's Full of jokes, these bananas. That is I true. I am raising my hand. So this has got, so a whole plot, to be clear, could be potentially based around someone that stole a bag of all dressed chips and left and then got hit by a banana. banana. No. No one's created I a think show it's around false. that. I think it's false. I, I think it's false. I think it's, no, I think it's a real crime. You think it's a real, who? How do you write an episode around, if it's the plot line? If we something... wrote the first episode with a banana. Yeah, but that wasn't the plot line. That was just a but thing that happened. But it became the plot line. It was I a hit... thing that happened. It wasn't the plot line. Okay, what are you saying? We're going to say, oh, count of three and whatever you say, and then I'm going to say whatever I say. Ready? One, two, three. True crime. Fake. I told you it happened. I said that the first time. Can we go back to my original answer? That is I true. A group of retired men Ooh. read forensics for dummies. Okay? And then they stole $20 million of jewelry, cash, and gold from a bank safe deposit box. I want that to be true, but I think it could be. What do you think? I would do some stuff like that if I were a criminal. You would read Forensic for Dummies? I would again, skim I'm not Forensic for Dummies because again, that's the purpose of the book. I to would go to school it. and study how to be a detective. I think it's, I think, I think it's true. What do you want to say? I think it's a plot line. True! She ah! Ah! Thank you, thank you, you helped us out. Watch our show, it's really good. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're in a show together. We're in a show together. <laughs> just, just. Tune in. Just tune in. It'd be great. It'd be great. <laughs> Can we get a bag of chips if we win? All dress, please. That's my favorite since I've been to Toronto. I'll have that. Here or just a plain lay. I mean, like lays the chip. 